peep at the numbers engaged amid the tropical vegetation of Ceylon. This British colony produces over a quarter of the world's tea. Trained fingers pick the triangular leaves that distinguish the Ceylon crop. Rice is another important product, though only primitive means are still employed to keep the water at the right level. But the simple hand-worked scoops are effective enough to raise two good rice crops a year. The slender palms, which always lean towards the sea, provide the natives with many things, including a good climb. In fact, the Singalese say they can build a house and furnish it, entirely from the palm tree. The most generous of the tree's gifts are coconut milk and oil. All the schools are government controlled, and the lesson the kiddies love best is the fascinating story of their own fair island. The men are keen fishermen, and at sunrise they set out in their catamarans, as their strange little craft are called, for the fishing ground. The boats are made from large tree trunks and without a single nail or screw. To the simple people of Ceylon, nature has been bounteous, and they are proud to be subjects of the King Emperor. A different